upside down cheesecake from Cheesecake Factory, the bomb. Okay. That's, that's what's up. Okay. Uh, favorite exercise? Favorite exercise? Yeah, I really like Zumba. I haven't been able to do it for a couple of months, but Zumba's pretty fun. Oh, you're, I get you're down a Zumba person too, huh? I don't, I don't do the Zumba. I just do, uh, I don't do the Zumba. Let's just keep going. <laughs> you know what? It would be really fun. We could totally do a Zumba class. It would be so much fun. I actually love hip hop dance class, like workout classes. But uh-huh. you know, there's, there, those are hard to find. So I started to get into. I mean, I'm not good at it. Don't ask me to dance. But, but Zumba's fun. You know, you keep up and just twirl around and burn calories. I mean, it's fun. You know, you okay. like it. All right, like so uh, most favorite mode of transportation? I mean, I love cars. Uh-huh. <laughs> I, love, I love a car. Um, like like airplane or car or boat? Like, is that what you mean? Any, any of them. Airplane, car, boat, uh, jet ski. Uh, oh, oh. Rifle, yeah. Anything like okay. that. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. You feel so like rollerblades, no skateboard, no. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, <laughs> No, I mean, I love any any type of car that's fast. I know I probably shouldn't say that, but I do. I love fast cars. We <laughs> think <laughs> <Okay>. fast lanes. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> okay. I, you know, and I love ferry rides. I know that sounds so funny, but I love going on a big old boat ferry, like, you know, just cruising on the water. I think that is awesome. Okay, so you'd love the Ferris wheel at the park then, right? I love the what? The Ferris wheel. Um, yeah, Ferris, Ferris was okay. Yeah, I like Ferris. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> uh, uh, favorite indoor out activity? Um, and favorite indoor activity would be shopping. I love shopping. Is that an um, indoor favorite? activity? <laughs> yeah, activity. You walk around, you try things on. <laughs> totally an activity. <laughs> uh, favorite, I'm gonna shoot a disclaimer to all the fellas real quick, man. Uh, um, you know, from even if you watch perspective, shopping is not an activity. That's only my opinion, and not express written consent of those listening to the show. Uh, please, if you have further questions, please email me at djcwalkersgmail.com. Uh, we can have a discussion about it. Thank you for your time. <laughs> and, and all of my women say, A to the man. Yes, <laughs> yes, shopping is an activity. <laughs> You do, man. You could, I mean, you could break a sweat by shopping around in the mall, man. You know, you have to go walk around from store to store. You got to try things on. You're trying shoes on. You're bending over. You're moving around. That's totally good. activity. Ma'am, ma'am, I, uh, I have a good friend in Texas who went and um, we went to visit. And me and him and, and his wife and we all went to the mall. Well, subsequently, we went to the movies and the women stayed in shop. So... Let that be a lesson, fellas. There's always an alternative. (laughs) (laughs) That's true. That is very true. (laughs) Favorite outdoor activity? Uh, Favorite outdoor activity? Mm. You know, I I really do. I enjoy going for walks. I mean, especially if it's like on a beach or something like exciting like that. I like to go for walks. Or if it's okay. like at sunset around my neighborhood, I think that's fun. I like okay, so last two questions. The first one, most right. embarrassing high school moment. Embarrassing high school moment. Yep. Oh, well, can I can I go back earlier? I could have a really good one when I was earlier. <laughs> you can, you sure can. Okay, cause, okay, yeah. Instead of high school, let's like take it way back. We'll go to like elementary school. <laughs> <laughs> so I was in elementary school, right? And um, we were doing. Um, I was singing my very first solo, right? And it was at church, and it was on Mother's Day. And you like, you know, kids choirs. You know, they have like big old production. I think it was probably like, seven or eight. Like my very first solo. And um, had the kids' choir behind me, and I was right in front and center, and I you was know, singing my solo. And earlier that day, my one of my siblings, I won't mention which one, who uh, commented, your singing is going to be so bad, somebody's going to throw up. And I was like, oh, that's so mean, you know? And, um, you know, so I was kind of nervous, like, singing my solo. I had that in the back of my head. And I'm halfway through my solo, first solo ever. I'm doing really good. I'm excited. I'm like, I'm almost done. Like, I can do this. 
And then all of a sudden, I hear in the back from behind me, some kid starts throwing up in the middle oh, wow. of the choir, in the middle of the choir. And like all over the kids in front of her, all over the kids to the left and wow. to the right. And all of a wow. sudden, I turn around and I see kids taking off the stage. They're covered in puke, like kids running everywhere. Wow. <laughs> Parents start running up on stage to get their kids. And it was so oh. bad. It was terrible. That's amazing. <laughs> it was terrible. But but the great the great part about that was our pastor. He's, he's such an awesome man. He, um, he cleaned, after they cleaned everything up, they called all the kids back onto the stage, and he made me sing my solo over again, the whole entire song. And um, that was pretty cool because, you know, it was like, you're not going to be afraid. You're going to sing this song. We're going to do it again. So, okay. Embarrassing oh. moment, but hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Last question, man. Um, um, I know you're about to have a baby, so um, we want to make sure uh, you get the things you need for the baby. Um, here's answer me: what's the most what's the most desirable gift you want for your baby? And answer: see if you can answer that. For and, and I'm sorry, and answer what? The gift, the uh, gift you want for the baby, and see if you can answer it for Marco as well. So just let so what 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 you think Marco would want the baby to have, and what you think you would want the baby to have. Oh man! I mean, we're talking physically or like emotionally slash spiritually. We're here. talking about we're talking about physically because we're doing fun facts, so we don't want to go too deep into thought. You know what I'm saying? We don't oh, want to okay. make them like uh, I know I can, I probably can answer for the spiritually myself. You know what I'm saying? You know what? Yeah, you know practically, um, we we need a stroller and um. I've kind of been dragging my feet on buying a stroller. I don't know why. I, I kind of, you know, we're starting to, you know, get everything together now, and um, we're we're getting down to the last little bits and pieces of what we need. But um, we still need a stroller. <laughs> so that's probably a good thing for us to to go out and get, so we can, yeah, you know, yeah, you push might, around. You might, yeah, you might want to uh, get one of those. They might. Come in handy, being that you guys do a lot of walking, so that might come yeah. in handy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's a good point. I like to go for walks. I probably should get a stroller. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Fun Facts with Miss Natalie Via, man. Thank you uh, for participating in Fun Facts. Um, I hope those um, answers enlighten our viewers. And for those of you listening to the show, um, there's always a Fun Fact with DJ T. Walk. Um, don't be hesitant to ask a question. It could break the ice, so... Just have your phone facts ready to shoot and fire at rapid pace. And if you have a question for Miss Maddie Via, be, be sure to email her, tweet her, or get at her in one of her ways that she will now tell you how to get at her now. Yes, you can find me. My website is natalievia.com. It's via is B I L L A. And all of my social sites Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, uh, YouTube. It's all Ms. Natalie Via. So it's M-S Natalie Via V-I-L-L-A. Hit me up. Love to hear from you. Would love to chat with you. Check out my music videos on my YouTube. Check me out on Facebook. Love to talk to you. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so do a quick promo. Uh, do a quick promo for the CD so they can go um, grab the CD as well. Yes, and you can um, you can find... Um, uh, my new EP uh, Fast Lane on iTunes um, or you can check it out we have information on our website too but um, go to iTunes and you can get it there um, $5 you know five songs that's what I'm talking about that's Check a bumper song, man. Y'all can get it. Hey, listen, that's that's actually a good deal because if you think about it, most songs are 99 cents, so just go and donate the other, what is that, 5 cents, and you got a whole CD, folks. So, mm -hmm. I want to thank Miss Natalie Via for coming on. Now, listen, on the website, folks, it's not B-I-A. It's B-I-L-L-A. So, you got to go Natalie Via. Now, uh, I know some of you might pronounce that Villa like I do because I'm just uh, a weirdo. <laughs> But anyway, uh, it's Natalie Via. <laughs> it's Natalie Via. 
And so uh, when you get at her, man, be sure. And when you go to the site, man, there's a free download for LOL so you can get, uh, get updates on her music. And then become a follower. Subscribe to her page um, so you guys can get updates. Um, she can let you know when she's dropping a video. And she probably, going to be here, she probably let you know when the baby is here and probably take a thousand pictures because she just does that. <laughs> oh man, first baby, of course. I, uh, I, yes, I'm sure Marco and I will be very proud parents. You'll All right, we'll tell her, I'm sure. <laughs> we'll tell Marco I said what's up, and um, I'm glad y'all doing things, man, the Christian way. I'm so proud of you guys uh, for dropping the EP. Thank you. And um, I know you guys will be on the up for, for a little bit due to the baby and everything. Uh, I'm glad you guys are just doing well and great. And um, I'm glad to have you on the show for the second time. Um, and I think this is going to be the, um, the, the, the longer version of the interview. So you guys get more in depth uh, into who Miss Nalidia is. And you get the fun facts, man. What can you do without fun facts? You know, fun facts are great. They're an excellent way to uh, get to know an individual. So uh, especially if you're trying to uh, purchase them something or find out where they're going to be hiding so you can get 50,000 autographs. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Ms. Vian, for coming on the Ready Hour. Um, in the course of the show, I want to say um, I appreciate you coming on and uh, have a wonderful day. And please keep us up to date on uh, thank the Thank you. Uh, we uh, well. DJ T-Walk, we love you so much. You're, uh, you're uh, our man. So thank you so much for having us and for having uh, me and Love you. <laughs> All right, anything you want to say before we get ready to get out of here? I'm sorry, what? Anything you want to say before you before we get out of here um, to let people know what, what they need or let me know what I need or anything like that? No, you guys keep listening to DJ T Walk and his show. Awesome. He's doing awesome work. And check me out. Hit me up You know, on all my social sites. I want to hear from you. And God bless you guys. So, all right. Well, talk to you soon. <laughs> All right, Red Hour DJ T Walk Man signing off, man. Uh, thank you, Miss Nancy, for coming on, and we look forward to chatting with you again. All right. Mm-hmm. You got it. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Okay, bye. Go, Red DJ T Walk.